How to sharpen any knife with nothing more than a ceramic mug, as well as a sheet of cardboard. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate sharpening a cutting edge with the ceramic and then stropping it with the cardboard. When we sharpen a knife, we're referring to taking steel off of the cutting edge to thin it out, thus making it sharp again. Stropping is refining all of the little micro serrations that cutting edges are comprised of to further the edge and make it perform even sharper. So let's see how this cutting edge currently is doing. Oof, not very good. Yeah. You'd almost call that a utility edge, I suppose, but it's certainly not razor sharp. Let's check out a blade that is razor sharp. Same blade steel, same profile. That's the result we should be getting something closer to. So just take the bottom portion of a coffee mug. This is exposed ceramic, which is harder than steel, meaning it can sharpen it, potentially. Other side, make sure it's even, so both cutting edges are evenly sharpened. Because we have a belly on this cutting edge, like most blades have, you can see the angle I'm rotating it on, or pivoting it on. You can go back and forth if you wish. You can also go in circles once you find that cutting edge. One way you can tell this is working, see how much darker this side of the rim of the mug is compared to the rest of it? That's the steel getting sharpened away. Let's check out how we are right now. Oh yeah. Already it's a lot better. That's already pretty damn sharp, but we can actually further this. We can continue to resharpen if we wish, but I like to sharpen as little as possible and strop as much as possible. The reason for this is, again, every time you sharpen a blade, it's, it's almost nothing, but technically you are removing steel off of the blade. Stropping, however, we're not actually removing anything. We're simply refining and straightening out the edge. Any exposed side of cardboard like this on the side, and instead of cutting toward it as if we were sharpening it, we're actually going to go backwards. You don't even have to press that hard. Just you know, moderate amount of strength. And just make sure it's even on both sides. And if the cardboard begins to flatten, it may not strop as well as it could. So you can just flip it around or just cut through this and use the other exposed piece. Cardboard, even in 2023, is still pretty cheap. Now let's see where we are. Oh, yeah. Nice. So in a pinch, if you don't have the proper tools for sharpening any bit of exposed ceramic, whether it's a mug or a dinner plate or whatever, and any sheet of cardboard will work. Feel free to try this for yourself and let me know how it goes. Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to subscribe and that little bell notification if you do not want to miss weekly knife and gun videos. And feel free to support me on Patreon, link in the description. Good luck. Thanks so much for watching.